Okay, mommy, I'm ready to go. Okay, bye. That's suspicious. That's weird. You're not gonna ask me where I'm going. You already told me last week. It's okay, you can go. It's a trap. You're not gonna complain about my makeup, my outfit, nothing. No. Wait, let me give you some money. Yeah! So you can have fun. I'm gonna give you money to go out. I never spell it. This is a trap. You know what? Have everything. Hey! You know what? I don't wanna go anymore. Why? I think I'm sick. <gasps> and also I have dishes to wash, so Alright, thank you. <laughs> Mommy, uh, uh, what is it again? So, let's play a roasting game. You say it's there, you add the roast, and you end it for me. So, it's there, da -da -da -da, for me. You get it? Oh, I think I got it. I'm gonna use this moment to tell her everything I feel. It's the walking around being useless for me. It's the get the remote while it's next to you for me. It's the always failing your semester for me. <gasps> it's the always beating me when I didn't do anything for me. It's the never washing the dishes for me. Pull up, pull up. You know what? It's the ratchet grandma glasses for me. <gasps> it's the always sitting on this damn couch and being on your phone and being unproductive for me. Continue. It's the wake up early in the morning to worship for me. Ah. Chai! Oh my God. God is Run. Gracie! Yes, mommy. When Auntie Mercy knocks at the door, please tell her I'm not here, okay? Mommy, you want me to lie? Don't you remember the Ninth Commandment? Thou shalt not lie, you know? You're right, but God has given me a pass today, so do not worry about it, eh? It's between me and God. Say what I exactly told you. I am not here. You get. You always adjust Jesus' words when it fits you. Hmm. Hey, I think she's here. Go. Hey Grace, is your mom around? I told her I was coming. Mommy told me to tell you that she's not here. Your mom said that? Where is she then? Wait, let me ask her. <coughs> Mommy, she's asking where you went. Um, tell her I went to the market. She said she went to the market. Okay, when she comes back, eh? Tell her I came by, okay? Okay. <coughs> Gracie! Mommy, you called me. I was wondering, how do you cope with anger, you know, after I pissed you off? What do you usually do? I usually clean around, you know? What does cleaning have to do with all of this? How does it help you deal with your feelings? Well, I use a toothbrush because it's really soothing. I love her. I love her. I love her. Chai! Oh my God. Gracie! Pull up, pull up. Yes, Mommy, you called me. Okay, I need you to help me win this game. So you have to give me three names of an animal that starts with the letter M. That's easy. Um, monkey. Okay. Continue. Mouse and... Mommy. You be Mumu. Chai! Yeah, it's Oh my God. <laughs> Mommy? Uh, uh, what is it again? Okay, so if you answer this series of questions correctly, I promise, eh? That for 2021 you will not even hear me disturb you okay i like the sound of that okay first what goes up but never comes down your stupidity of course but not everything has to do with me the answer is your age why are you talking to like this am i your mate why is the answer your age Continue. mike's mom has four kids penny nickel dime and that's easy quarter Mama, I said Michael's mom has four kids. I said quarter, that's the correct answer. What are you talking about? Mama, I said Michael's mom, quarter. Michael is the answer. Quarter, that's the correct answer. Your IQ is lower than my GPA. <gasps> After you're gonna be the one bragging, bragging that back in the days you were smart. Mama, if you know what's better for you, eh? Please get a relationship with your books instead of your phone. Continue. Oh, shh. <laughs> Gracie, why are you sweating? I mean, I just had a nightmare. What was it about? It was about the fact that you were overly nice. And also, you also bought me a house to make me happy. Yeah. Not even to mention the car. Chai! Hmm. Ah, that's not a nightmare. No, 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 mommy, it is a nightmare. Because anything good coming from me is always a trap. It's like you and the devil. There is no difference. Jesus is Lord! Are you normal? Are you normal? Are you normal? Not again. Run. <laughs> Mommy, I still don't get it. It's like you're trying to finish the brain cells that I have left. Eh? 
You have 8,000. Your sister takes 4,000. How much would you have left? Mommy, I still have 8,000. I will slap you back to 2019 if you don't stop this rubbish. Are you mad? Where is the 8,000 coming from? My green. Huh? What are you trying to say? When it comes to money, sharing is not caring. Oh my god. Can we start again from question one? I'm not doing it again. It's only Jesus. Get out of right here, man. Mommy, can I ask you a question? I, I, what is it again? Um, I was wondering, can I get in trouble for something I didn't do? No, if you didn't do anything, you won't get in trouble. Why? Okay, so in that case, I did not take the meat out of the freezer like you asked. Yes, you! Baby Mumu, you think so you're wise? Run. Pull up, pull up. Christy, what are you writing? Well, I'm writing my New Year's resolution, you know, because this year I want to have a six pack. I always knew this girl was stupid. I just didn't know to what it means. You see your life. Instead of asking for more common sense, you're here asking for six packs. Yeah. Eh? Instead of asking for, oh, mommy, I'm going to be more useful this year. Oh, mommy, I'm going to treat you right. Oh, mommy, I'm going to buy you a big car. Look at your mates. Your mate is buying big car for their moms. Yeah. What are you doing? Eh? You're just here breathing like a heavy dog. You're here chomping, always chomping like a beaver. Beaver. Walking around, always looking like a confused goat. If you know what's best for you, better get your senses right. Okay, mama, I heard you. But know for a fact, I'm going to change the day you stand up from the couch and the day you find yourself a real job. Until then, please stop being a lukewarm Christian, okay? Thank you. Not again. It's okay, I'll do it. Gracie! Yes, mommy. Quick question. If your auntie gives you $10,000, okay, and I take $5,000, how much would you have? I have ten thousand hey! dollars. How? Because only a fool will give you five thousand dollars. I would never ever give you five thousand dollars. Why? Hey, Run. Gracie. Yes, mommy. You called me. Now that you're a full-grown adult, you need to move out of my house. Because the more you stay in this house, the useless you become, and the more you ferment. Mommy, if this is so. Why is Jesus for more than 2,000 years still living with his dad? Hey! Tell me. It's quiet. Ain't no back talk. I'm supposed to be here of this. I'll move out when Jesus does. Until then, woman, please respect yourself and do not disturb my peace. Now, I know you ain't talking to me. Hey! You know you can't be prosecuted for that. You will move out of this house. Run. Today, I'm going to cash if this girl took my $50. Gracie! Yes, mommy, you called me. I left $100 on my table and now I can't find it. Do you know where it is? Mommy, it was not $100, it was $50. How do you know it was $50? Because when I took it. Jesus! You think so, you're wise? You be Mumu? Mumu, man! Run. 